playing a game called Black Ice. And in this game, you're pretty much... Um, it's a cyberpunk-based game, pretty much. You have to, uh, hack a bunch of servers because a bunch of evil, evil corporate, um, companies have taken over the world or such and such. I don't know. I don't know the story behind it. But nonetheless, um, you can do multiplayer, and the cool thing about multiplayer is you do not have to port forward in order to host a server that your friends can connect to. It's... It's pretty interesting. Um, you also have stats. So, say for an example, if I level up, I can individually select a stat. stuff, you can go to the shop, you can sell stuff, this is what a shop would look like, and that building right there, that is your goal, you want to be able to hack that building, and you've beaten this game, pretty much, so, there's a shop, you can sell stuff, I got all this crap I don't want, I don't care, sell all of it so I can buy good stuff from the shop. I don't care what I pick up. Oh, Grey Hat Machu. That's Black Hat. That's Grey Hat. That'll increase my hack speed. They also have mod chips you can equip. So, say for an example, um, you want to go faster. Or you want to fly faster pretty much equip a mod chip and that'll raise your stats a little bit. That sort of thing. I apologize if I'm kind of talking kind of mumbly and kind of, you know, not feeling too great. Um, I'm kind of tired. I apologize for that. my hack speed to increase, I'd hit a add button and add a point, or remove a point. I had to remove. And then you simply confirm your talents, and so on and so on. So you have to manually select, um, what kind of skill you want, which is something I don't really care for. It's still a fun game. It's made using Unity, so the graphics aren't that too great, but still, gameplay is kind of decent. You know, the concept is pretty cool. And the fact that you can play online without having to port forward is also pretty cool, too. Then again, you probably have to rely on some sort of Take me 
to the uh, end screen for some reason. Cyber laser does that. Well, I guess I'll equip this cyber laser because. Nah. That's fine. I, I need something with a higher rate of fire. like that, only the other way around. You can also, if you click on this, you can get information on each individual server, so it says, Dynamics specialize in seizing national territory. They also rumored to research horrifying new medical procedures on their own citizen. So, these guys look pretty bad, but their hack difficulty is uh, 147, so I'm not gonna bother them. So, so, hardware groups also rumored to cause natural disasters in order to grudge the nearby populations. Alright, and it's 27, so it shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, I can't, I can't say, I can't pronounce. 
announce things today for some reason. So, yeah, it's, it's a fun game. Um, I'll probably post a link to the game in the description. Um, it's on Steam if you have Steam. So, pretty much.